This is H.D. Ingalls, and this piece is titled Thomas Jefferson's Accomplishments. This information contains excerpts from my book, A Stroll Through American History, in the chapter named Thomas Jefferson, 1743-1826. Thomas Jefferson was our first Secretary of State, our second Vice President, and our third President, a very orderly succession and something which can never be done again. Thomas Jefferson was a genius. Not only could he read English, he could read Greek, Latin, French, Italian, and Spanish. He could speak English, French, Italian, and Latin. To give an example of what Jefferson read, he read Cicero in Latin, Plato in Greek, Montesquieu in French, and Cervantes in Spanish. To better un understand the poet Ossian, he studied Gaelic. Much has been written about Thomas Jefferson. I am mere merely documenting a few of his many achievements. The Declaration of Independence was written by Jefferson in a period of a little over two weeks. An act called the Virginia Statute for Religious Freedom was written by Jefferson and was adopted by the Virginia legislature in 1786. An interesting point. The Bill of Rights was ratified in 1791, five years after the Virginia Statute for Religious Freedom was adopted. Jefferson was an architect. He designed his home, Monticello, and the University of Virginia. Many of Jefferson's inventions are really innovations of something already invented. Jefferson had a passion for tinkering and improving things. Jefferson designed the great clock in Monticello, a duplicating machine, and many other clever things. In 1803, President Jefferson made the Louisiana Purchase. It was a land deal between the United States and France in which the U.S. acquired approximately 828,000 square miles of land west of the Mississippi River for 15 million. The Lewis and Clark expedition began in 1804. President Thomas Jefferson gave Meriwether Lewis the job of exploring the Louisiana Purchase and beyond. Thanks for listening.